Well, on behalf of Dr. Andre and Pastor Jenny Raybert, welcome to an exciting episode of Behind the Faith. And I am not alone, not with my beautiful wife this time, oh, but wow. with, um, how do I describe you, Jade? Jade. Jade. Yeah, Jade. <laughs> hey, family, delightful December. That's Come right. on, so good to be back with you all around the nations of the world, and we're so blessed to be with you. Now, get ready for another jam-packed episode of Behind the Faith. Jade, what are your plans for December? Tell the truth, fam. Eating too much or just running? Okay, so running, let's, let's give it a good balance. I think eating a bit... A little bit and then a little more than a bit but I mean I can see you well ahead already but uh, <laughs> most definitely I'm um, gonna be enjoying some good food and then obviously spending time with the family and then running not running away from problems but running by faith come not on running from family and <laughs> not running from family <laughs> but hey family it is good to be back with you and we're running into your homes today all around the world we're so excited for today's program yeah man be a part of what's going on on social media be a part of us at my faith TV on Facebook Instagram and Twitter yeah. actually one thing we never really yeah, talk about Twitter. is Twitter you know it's so exciting so be a part of us there on Twitter Don't don't forget, YouTube is a place where you can always connect yeah. with our live events as well. As, you know, Jade, I'm so excited with yeah. Faith now <clears throat> expanding, growing. Newsmax just came on beginning yeah. of this month. Exactly. So another platform, another channel. And I'm so excited of some, some of the stuff that's going to be happening. Because yeah. one of the new things we've got yeah. on Behind the Faith yeah. is the Global News Alliance, right? Yes, yes. So GNA has been joining us right now. We're going to be having some stories from them yeah. today on today's yeah. program. But what's exciting is everything that people can actually watch, or if yeah. they've missed it, can always connect on Faith Now. Indeed, you know the, ble the, the, the blessing or the best thing, the blessed thing, the best thing about, about Faith Now is that it's available on your handheld device anywhere on demand whatever time you want to watch wherever you are whoever you are with you can just simply take out your handheld device your ipad whatever it is i mean you can have five subscriptions on on i mean five devices with one script subscription so you can have it on multiple devices you're able to watch good faithful content right. christian content on demand wherever you are and then there's radio stations as well as link fm linking people to jesus and we know that so many of you are if you've not yet downloaded faith now we know we want to encourage you to do so i know that many of you have already done so but please do so and then share it you know share it with your friends your family be a blessing to those i mean th this december you could actually buy someone a christmas present yeah faith now faith now could yeah. be your christmas present so faith now can be your christmas yeah. turn so for this delightful december be a part of the faith family of networks be a part of what we're doing right here at the faith broadcasting network Tell me what Christmas is all about. Jesus is the reason for the season. December is going to be the most delightful season of my life. Christmas is a time of giving, of fellowship, of fun. It's a time where we honor the birth of our Lord Jesus Christ. The Bible describes a virgin giving birth in a stable, a child lying in a manger, shepherds being visited by angels, and wise men following a star. If you have no faith, you cannot believe this story because it doesn't make sense. Wouldn't it be amazing if this Christmas season, that that light, that the Magi followed, that Shekinah glory of God, the presence of God, entered into your life and into your heart and illuminated the darkness. It doesn't matter how 2021 started. It's how it's going to end. God loves you just as you are, and you're so precious to him. So much so that he went to the cross just for you. Your heart needs to be just like God's heart, especially if you're delighting yourself, therefore, in him. You can't have the joy of Christmas without the worship of Jesus. But buddy, when you know that Jesus is the greatest gift ever given to us, it's going to be the best Christmas of your life. Delight yourself also in the Lord, and he will give you the desires and the secret petitions of your heart. And that is Delightful December. This Delightful December, we have so much happening on the network, especially for you to be empowered. So Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays at 10 p.m. Central African time, you can catch the Supernatural Now with Guillermo Maldonado. Always a feast, always empowering. And on Tuesdays, at 3.30 p.m. I know some of you watch this, even though you're a little older, as far as the audience is concerned, but there's Superbook 
all the way from CBN and it is empowering. I know Shantae really, really loves Superbook and so does Judah. And of course, Zion, who is the new addition to the family. And speaking of Shantae, she had this amazing conversation. I, I know some of you have seen it. Some of you honestly have not seen it. And I know you're going to be empowered by this, but she had a conversation with Yolanda Magida, who's all the way in Cape Town, the mother city right here in South Africa, who's from CBN Africa, and they were talking about all things Superbook. It was one great interview, and I know you are looking forward to hearing what they had to talk about. So I'm not going to delay any longer. I'm just going to let you go ahead and take a look. Superbook, South Africa. this awesome privilege we are with Yolanda from the Superbook team and we are ready to catch up with her I hope you are too Yolanda it's so good to be hi. with you hi how are you I'm doing good how are you doing we're, we're great Big Town is treating us well <laughs> oh that's so awesome you know what you we are interviewing you today um, based on Superbook the awesome children's program I mean I have to say I must be one of your biggest fans I think I love watching Superbook more than my one-year-old does tell us more about Superbook what is what is the heart behind the program what is the purpose of Superbook okay before I even start I just want to say Kujo to parents uh, we survived 2020 uh, we are entering a new year. I know how it is to be a parent. I'm a parent as well of two children. And, and in a nutshell, that, that is what school's purpose is, to come alongside caregivers, parents, such as myself, myself, um, in nurturing young children's spiritual development, in fostering spiritual formation. And, and, and that's basically our passion. That's basically our purpose as, as a team um, and yeah and often people would often ask what 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 spiritual formation um, and, and simply put it's 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 any content any information any uh, uh, knowledge structure that that actually informs the children's uh, value system or even adults as alike um, in order for them to become better characters and in a nutshell, that is what Superbook is all about. Um, providing content for children so that they have characters that we that are formulated around the word of God and, and Jesus himself. Yeah. Wow, that is so awesome because I know from watching the program, the way you integrate real life, obviously in animation form, real life, real stories from Joy, Chris and Gizmo and then relating it back to a bible story what we can learn from that i think that is such a, an interesting and powerful practical tool that we can use to get the spiritual formation within our kids but tell me what is that or is that all that you guys the the purpose behind superbook that practical tool of integrating real life with the bible is that what your main focus is on as well yeah, so what, what sets Superbook apart besides being a digital, being in the digital space, um, is providing content and program. I mean, Superbook is huge. Uh, we've got DVDs, we've got uh, the Superbook app, we've got the Superbook website, we've got videos and games. Basically, all of these programs and activities are, are all going to one place and one place only elevating the word of God and trying to make sure that the children have an appetite for the word of God because we believe that the word of God really um, impacts people's character and that's what it's supposed to do that we, we live and breathe the word of God yeah. so we often believe that it's not enough for children to have that content on a Sunday but it's important for them to have it on a Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. And our thinking has been, how do you get into children's spaces? Mm. And hence, we have the app. So it's very practical, very user-friendly, um, and designed to kind of, yeah, just to get the kids being part of a community that allows them to, to, to consume a content, um, aka the Bible, um, so that their, their, their characters are, are formulated. And parents play a huge, huge role in this. 
because we are the gatekeepers um, ultimately. Yeah. yeah, that's so powerful. As parents, we are the gatekeepers. I mean, we are the ones that disciple our kids. Our kids are our first and number one disciples here on earth and we need to rear them in the right way. And I mean, and sometimes we just need to do a few things, a couple of things at home. And it's so easy to just put your child in front of the TV. Why not put them in front of Superbook? Open the app, put it on TV, wherever you can find Superbook, use those mediums to, yeah. like Yolanda said, to solidify that Christian foundation, that spiritual foundation Absolutely. in your child. Yolanda, lastly, will you just tell every parent out there, what are the benefits of, ha of having a strong spiritual foundation? Okay, so I'll just mention one, and I love reading them because they, 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 they're pretty long. I often have a long list. And, and one of them is that we, we normally have happier children. Uh, they are more optimistic. They're more thriving, they're more flexible, and better to equip with the struggles of life. I mean, wow. with 2020 and 21 coming in, you, you really want children with strong characters and the zeal for the Word of God to be able to, to withstand the, the, the errors of the world and whatever comes their way, they'll be able to stand for the Word of God. And so parents really play a pivotal role, as you said, um, in this formation. Um, and often as well, with, with all the, the programming, I, I wanted to leave parents with just this one advice. Um, and I think I am speaking to myself as well. Uh, with the programming, with the activities, because we've got so many information coming our way. Um, I think time, spending time with your kids, uh, uh, is often the, the 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 main thing because that's 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 who they model their lives yes, around true. as well. They're watching us. Yes. So spiritual formation is not just for them, but it is for us as well to model for them. Um, and and yeah, and I'm also preaching to myself. <laughs> Time is often something that we we don't have, and and with this fast-paced life, um, so our challenge is to slow ourselves down and. And I, and, I, and I always get um, reminded of how my child often says, Mommy, come, come sit with me. Let's watch Superbook together. Um, and what, what better way to yeah. spend time with your child? And, and working through the, the Word of God and just chatting about the Word of God. Um, and again, it's, it's, it, this is what Superbook is all about, really coming alongside parents, caregivers, um, and really nurturing the children's spiritual yes. foundation. And yes, yeah. that is so good. So parents out there, you want to take this opportunity, download the app. I mean, we, we air it on FBN every Tuesday at 3.30 p.m. Central African time. You don't want to miss it. This is a way where you can disciple your kids in a fun and interactive way by literally putting on a really fun, yet interesting and proper show you you i'm telling your parents you will enjoy it too so we just want to say thank you Orlando, so much thank you superbook team for everything that you are doing for our families for our kids this is a way that we can really grow as a family in the word of god obviously especially for our kids we really hope that you enjoyed this interview today any final words um download the app <laughs> as you have Awesome. Awesome. And, um, yeah. awesome. All the best. Thank you so much. Meet Greta. Greta is a program director at a Christian online media outlet. Greta's producers create compelling videos about the good work being done by believers but they don't have the time or resources to tell all the stories they want to. Meet Luis. Luis is a video content creator who lives in a village in Latin America. He is telling stories of God's work around his home. But Luis has no audience. Global News Alliance helps get Luis's content to Greta's channel, expanding her creative team, telling important stories, and reaching more people. Greta's voluntary subscription to GNA puts money in Luis's pocket to help him tell more stories and transform his life and village. But GNA doesn't only do this for Greta and Luis.
They help connect audiences everywhere with content producers to help tell the world about Jesus. More stories means more people hear and participate in the work of God around the globe. Online programs, broadcasters, cable channels, schools, and churches are all connected to people, places, and events they might otherwise never hear about. Find out more about GNA and sign up for free at gna.news slash go. When Satu was just three years old, her legs began to bend. Her family could barely afford food every day, let alone an expensive surgery. Without access to treatment, her condition got worse over the years. Satu is six years old now and can no longer walk to school without help. Typically you get kids back home with some sort of deformity, but it's only 10 degrees usually. Young Satu is close to 50, so that's pretty, pretty massive. And yeah, it's gonna be a big operation to try to get it straight. After hearing about the arrival of a hospital ship in Senegal, Satu's mother brought her on board to receive free, life-changing surgery. Satu's mother had never dared to dream of a future where her daughter's legs would be straightened. She was afraid, but filled with hope. The operation was a resounding success. Now it was time for Satu to go through rehab and learn how to walk on her newly straightened legs. So it's so exciting to be a part of what's happening here. You know, I'm so blessed. I almost called you Tando, funny enough. I'm so used to talking to Tando, yeah? Are going to be a little, are gonna go a little what? A little bit shorter. <laughs> Yeah. But anyway, it's so exciting to ha you know to see what we're partnering with, you know, with the Mercy Mission story. It was so impressive, you know, that young girl, you know, like with her legs and what was happening, the operation. So it's a great support. But I'm so encouraged because we're a part of what they're doing and they're a part of what we're doing. And that's what partnership is all about. Indeed, that is what partnership is all about. And as well, you know, talking about partnership, mm. all of you, our faithful family, faith family and partners all around the world. It's, it's not only a blessing for you to be a partner with us, but also we are a blessing to you by by you know expanding the kingdom of God we see thousands if not millions of souls Come coming into the kingdom of God every single year that this network is around um, and, and on the platforms around the world and we want to encourage you to continue to be a part of what God is doing right here in the household of faith you know the Bible says it is more blessed to give than it is to receive and in this time that we find ourselves in obviously being delightful December not only are you being a blessing to those around you your family those closest to you but be a blessing to the kingdom of God by sowing a seed by partnering with what we are doing right here in Buffalo City from the Great Faith Dome. Because understand, not only are we going to meet you next year in 2022, I mean, it's exciting. We, we're about to step into 2022. But we want to encourage you to partner today. The Bible says that faith is now. And now faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not yet seen. You see, without hope, your faith cannot be actualized. And here's the reality of this, is that when you put your faith in God and you sow a seed of faith, understand, God is watching over His Word to perform it and He's faithful to bring the increase to that seed. So sow a seed in hope, knowing that, hey, there are countless lives that are going to be forever touched and changed and watch how your faith is actualized. Watch how God comes through for you and brings the increase to that seed and those kingdom souls, those souls that are accredited to your account in heaven. I tell you, it's not, not just an account, but I tell you, it's a blessing to be a part of what God is doing in this hour.
So that's what you're talking about when you talk about partnership, yeah. you know. It's such a vital thing as a team to stand together. And exactly. that's why we have so many faith ambassadors that are joining us in the course. You're like, what faith ambassadors? What are you talking about? The team that's always with us every yeah. single live event. And you're like, what live events? Well, where have you been? Monday to yeah. Thursday, it's Faith Today, 6 p.m. Central African time. And then every Friday, the NXT Live, bring the young people in, also from 6 p.m. Central African time. And then as we we always say, or always as Tando as says, Tando would say, yeah. <laughs> on a Sunday, take me to church. Yeah. So that's Faith Worship, 9 a.m. Central African time, where you can be a part of praise and worship and get into the word of the Lord. Well, it's been great having you guys yeah. join us today. It's been so exciting to have each and every single one of you partnering with us and making the choice right now to be a part of this ministry. On behalf of Dr. Andre and Pastor Jenny Rabin, we love you. God bless you. See you next time. <laughs>